Hey what's up guys welcome to customize the droid this is an overview video of the rom named super jelly bean 8.0 so let's check it out let's have a look at the lock screen itself so this is a typical uh, jelly bean lock screen which we get nothing new uh, just a stock lock screen which we get normally in all the jelly bean rom so this is a lock screen let's have a look at the home screen itself first let's see what all options which we get in this rom itself so if you long press the home screen with the we get the option to change the wallpapers directly from here so you get all the kitkat related wallpapers right here so you can set the wallpapers and you can select the wallpapers right from here or you can also select the images from the gallery itself so we can we have the option to pick an image from the gallery so you can set that wallpaper right from here and we get the option to add widgets on your home screen here it will load all the widgets on your phone so you can add the widgets right from here and we get the settings options this settings option is basically the option of the kitkat launcher so this the kitkat launcher has came pre installed on this rom itself so these are all the settings which we get for the kitkat launcher the desktops and the drawer the dock option for the folder and etc so you can check it out so these are all, all the options which we get right away from the home screen so that's pretty much it in the home screen i have kept only one long uh, home screen the google now features uh, happens to be working pretty much fine in this form so i'll just show you the google now so let me launch the google now first who is narendra modi So you see the Google Now function is working fine. Let's try some other search. Okay Google. Who is Sachin Tendulkar? According to Wikipedia, Sachin Ramesh Tendulkar is a former Indian cricketer widely acknowledged as one of the greatest batsmen of all time. So you see the Google Now function is working pretty much fine in this ROM. So you can try this option. So now let's have a look at the app drawer itself. So this is the app drawer. This is the basic app drawer. By looking at this app drawer, you see you get the pretty much a stock-like experience of the Android. So we get we have some of the Google apps which came pre-installed on this phone, and there are some of the, some other apps which are uh, installed. So you get the KitKat launcher. We you get the Play Music app, uh, and uh, you get the Super User app, obviously pre-installed on this phone. and you get the dsp manager for the equalizer uh, i must say that the uh, music quality that is the sound quality on the headphone just because of this dsp manager is 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 just awesome i'm using this rom just for the music uh, otherwise this rom is a bit laggy uh, at sometimes obviously uh, as this is a custom rom you might find that uh, there is a bit a uh, little bit of lag here or there so that's pretty much it with the uh, to add draw let's have a look in the settings options so let's get into the setting option so this is the settings options of the rom so we have the basic settings over here we get the lock screen setting that is you can uh, customize the lock screen the way you want it we get the themes option you get only one theme so we need to stick out with the uh, one theme uh, we get the system option in this system option you get the option to customize the status bar your uh, notification bar the wallpaper the font size the power menu and the hardware key now in the status bar you get the option to change the clock to change to customize the uh, network signal of your phone and also to customize the battery status of the phone so you get the options over here to customize the status bar you get the option over here to customize the notification panel of your phone so that is this the widget button so you can select all the widget buttons right from here and customize it i have kept few over here so that's my notification panel so that's uh, that's pretty much it with the notification draw we get the option to change wallpaper and etc and here we have down over here let's go and check the about phone option in the about phone option you see the android version 4.1.2 that is the jelly bean rom so and the basic information about your phone and it is based on the cyanogen mod so you can you will be able to see 
the Cyanogen mod version 2.24 the unofficial topic Topica SS so that's pretty much it about the status of the phone so that's pretty much it about this ROM. The special thing about this ROM I would like to speak about is that developer has tried giving you most of the KitKat UI experience on this tipo. So go ahead and do try it out. Uh, hope you will like it. So that's pretty much it in this review video of the Super Jelly Bean 8.0. Go ahead and try this ROM and install this ROM on your phone. In order to install this ROM, you can check the description column below. The video link is available. Let me know about your review about this ROM in the comment column below after installing and using it for a while so that's pretty much it in this video if you guys enjoyed this video do hit the like button and comment on the comment column in case of any queries don't forget to subscribe to my channel to stay updated with my videos i have been uh, searching for the tipo dual rom as well so once i get one of the stable rom i will definitely make a video on that don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that's pretty much it in this video till then enjoy customizing your phone with this new rom that is super jelly bean 8.0 i will see you guys in next video